And the lines just as long or, well, even longer at Kapolehale in West Oahu. People there also waiting for several hours. Our Kristen Gonzalez has been at Kapolehale all day. So what's the latest, Kristen? Marissa, thousands of people stood in line today here at Kapolehale, and there's still about 300 of them still waiting in line. Election officials say this could last until midnight. Some of them have been waiting up to six hours to cast their vote, even braving the rain. Now, Senator Brenton Awa is the last in line amongst voters, hoping to make a difference. They want to be able to live in Hawaii. You know, we see so many locals being pushed out. The nurses are fighting for their jobs. We bring in outside nurses. The teachers are fighting for their jobs. We bring in outside teachers. That is, that is the ammo of this, this government. We're saying, no, enough with, our, enough with that. Now, even though it was a frustrating experience, these voters say they still rather vote in person because they don't trust the mail-in process. And they say it's a small price to pay to get the right politicians in government to help with the high cost of living here in the islands. Reporting live, Kristen Concilio, Island News.